what we do here is go back, 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 back. Good afternoon, DC. I'm Wesley. And I'm Jameson. Today is Tuesday, October 31st. Anyone interested in riding the pet bus to the boys' soccer semifinals, you need to pick up a form in the front office today, and it needs to be returned by 3.15. If you are wanting to ride the pet bus for the girls' game, the form needs need to be returned tomorrow by 3.15. The cost is $10, and that will cover the bus ride and the ticket. Any questions, see Coach Logston in the athletics office. Sign-ups for Powder Puff Football will begin today. Forms are available in the front office. The cost is $15 to play, which includes a shot. Forms are money due this Friday. Practice will start next week. See Coach Brennan for more information. Members of Spanish Honor Society and Spanish Club are invited to a Day of the Dead celebration on Thursday, November 2nd from 3.30 to 5.30 in room 203. See Ms. Larson for more information. Now stay tuned for the October Students of the Month. For my monster from his slab began to rise And suddenly, to my surprise He did the match He did the monster match The monster match It was a graveyard smash He did the match It caught on in a flash He did the match He did the monster match wow. From my laboratory in the castle east wow. To the master bedroom where the vampires peace wow. Wow. The ghouls all came from their humble to get a jolt from my electrode They did the mash They did the monster mash The monster mash It was a graveyard smash They did the mash It caught on in a flag They did the mash They did the monster mash The zombies were having fun The party had just begun The guests included Wolfman Dracula and his son the scene was rocky, all were digging the sounds Igor on chains, backed by his baying hounds The coffin bangers were about to arrive With their vocal group, the Crypt Kicker Five They played the match They played the monster match The monster match It was a graveyard smash They played the match It caught on in a flash They played the match They played the monster match Members of Spanish Honor Society and Spanish Club are invited to a Day of the Dead celebration on Thursday, November 2nd from 3.30 to 5.30 in room 203. See Miss Lawson for more information. Stay tuned for a word from Renaissance. Hey DC, this is Miss Goodchub. I'm the Renaissance Coordinator, but most of you know me as the Candy Bar Lady. So, I have information for you. So, I got my big eyes on, I got my big mouth on, I want you to get your big ears on. I'm happy to announce that you have a Renaissance Rally in January. However, we need two things. We need people who can do the work, but we also want to make sure people understand what it takes to be able to attend. So, to attend this Renaissance Rally, you have to have this semester, this semester's grades only, a 2.5 GPA at the end of the semester. We'll get a list, we'll know who's eligible. So, watch your grades, keep them up. Secondly, watch your attendance. Renaissance rewards for in attendance. So we want you to have fewer, no more than five uh, unexcused absences. So good grades, good attendance, and you get to go to the rally in January. Lastly, I mentioned workers. We need uh, Renaissance workers. So if you want to be involved in a club that does not pay, ask you to pay dues, but just asks you to be a good, enthusiastic worker, then do this. Uh, you need to check your student email account and you need to check a message from me. It was sent to everybody in the school. Everybody in the school. Uh, check that. If you're interested, follow the directions to join our Google Classroom. Join that and get more information. And I need you to do that by the end of next week. So, thank you Panthers. Thank you for selling. Thank you for loving DC. And let's help spread the joy of our awesome school culture. Check out this video from the DCHS Ride Club about an exciting service project that you can get involved with starting next week. 
The Pulsera Project is a fair trade nonprofit organization that works with artisans in Nicaragua and Guatemala and provides a market for their handmade bracelets, or pulseras, in schools across the U.S. Each pulsera costs only $5 and comes tagged with the photo and the signature of the artist who made it. Money raised from your school's Pulsera sale will sustain employment for nearly 200 artisans and will also fund housing, healthcare, scholarships, social enterprises, and other empowerment programs that benefit the artists and communities throughout Central America. Thank you so much for your support and have an amazing time coloring the world with the Pulsera Project in your school. Pulseras will be sold November 6th through 17th at the Y Club table in the lobby during lunch, or you can find a Y Club member wearing the colorful Pulsera lanyards throughout the school. Remember, your $5 could change lives and help color the world. Attention anyone think thinking about taking the ACT in December. The last day to register for the December 9th ACT is this Friday, November 3rd to avoid late fees. To register for the test, go to ACT.org. Any junior or senior that is on free and reduced lunch can pick up a waiver for the test in the guidance office. Any student wanting to register for accommodations can see Ms. Mathis in room 138. Any questions, please see Ms. Powers in guidance or Mr. Pippin in the CCR Center. <laughs> if you're interested in going on a spring break trip to Roman Athens, the deadline to sign up is November 1st. If you are planning to go, please sign up soon as there are only a few spots left. To pick up more information or ask questions, see Mr. Easley in room 213. It's not too late to get an FCCLA t-shirt. This year's t-shirt costs $10 and come in three different color options. Money is due to Ms. Hayden in room 118 by today. You don't have to be a club member to purchase a shirt. Here's what's going on today at DC. Still nothing. Stay spooky, DC. Have a great Halloween.